Alright, what's going on everyone? We're back, we're doing a haul video, we haven't done one of these in a long time. In fact, we haven't uploaded a video in a long time, so let's just appreciate the fact that I'm actually uploading something for a change. So, let's get rid of the talking, let's just get straight into it. I haven't bought loads, but I think there's some quite interesting pieces, some different footwear, some different jackets and things like that. So I'm going to get straight into it, and there's a little surprise sort of halfway through about, you know, personal business and things. So stay tuned for that, we're going to get straight into it now. So first thing we'll touch on is the t-shirts, covered these in my last video, won't go into too much details, they're from P and Co, so that's P and Co, it's a company, and um, follow them through Instagram, it's a really really cool, it's like an old fashioned, it's almost like an old Americana biker style brand, but you can see, you've got interesting branding on here, and you've also got different unique designs on the back, and everything like that, so really quite cool, that's the black one I've got, and um, I also got the white one here, which I'll quickly show, I did summarise these in my last video as well, but you can see on there, you've got some quite interesting artwork. Link will be in the description, it's called Peen Co, if you do want to buy anything, just put in the comment section when you're buying it, you know, additional comments, just put say I sent you, and you know, who knows, they might hook me up with a discount code for you guys or something like that, so just do that for us. On the next stuff. Alright, so the next one we've got here, very simple, it's a pocket square, effectively. This ties in quite well with our next piece, but you know. Wear however you want, but I've got a suit which is going to come up. I won't try the full thing on, I'll just show you it. It's a proper Conor McGregor style suit, strutting around, so it looks really good. But that, that just look, I thought it looked cool, so I bought it basically. Um, not much else to say about that. As, as for the suit, you know, just pretend I'm behind there. Uh, I'll quickly unzip it, as I say, I won't try it on, but uh, you can see that's what we're talking like a checkerboard suit. It's got quite an interesting liner inside it. Um, three piece suit. Got this for £99, full wool, should be about 320 quid. Um, they had it in the sale after Christmas, snatched that up straight away. I want a full three piece checkerboard suit, so that's perfect. Got little blue details on the buttons and things like that, so bought that one straight away. Really, really like that. As I say, I won't try it on, but you'll probably see it in future videos, so stay tuned for that one. Quickly, just get this one out of the way. So, I've got a jacket which I bought last week actually. So, here it is, it's, it was a steal. It's like your, your, not, your dry flip tech fleece kind of, it's your Nike top basically, but it's all, you know, hyper fuse, zips, everything like that. Should have been about £120, got it for £18 from the outlet. Um, I'm getting up really early in the morning at the gym now, about half five every morning, so it's quite dark, quite cold, so I now go for something a little bit warmer. Put it on at the start of the gym, warms your muscles up, and then that way you can get... You know, you can get straight into it, so much better. And that was only 18 quid, so thought I'd get that out of the way. Thought I'd show you that as well. Really, really comfortable. A little bit baggy on the arms, but that just means I need to work harder, doesn't it? So thought I'd show you that. On to these two other jackets. So I think you'll have seen this one quite a bit. I did buy this over the, the season, so that's why it's in the video. Levi's Sheepskin, I've had this on a few mini fit Fridays already. It's one of my favourite jackets, if not the favourite jacket at the minute. Really warm, but you can, you know, just rock it with pretty much anything. So... That's, that's been my favourite uh, jacket so far. I've already got a little bit of stain on the arm, which I can't get out, which is killing me. So that's really, really annoying us. The only other one, which I'll just dive straight into, was this. So as you can see, it's kind of like a Mac. Got it from Super Dry once again in the sale after Christmas. It's a really, really tight fit. So, you know, whereas that blue one I need to hit the arms more, this one I probably need to don't because there's not much room to play. But it was a really good price. It's about £60 instead of like 180 or something. So I bought that straight away. I'll quickly try this one on on so you can just see what it looks like. Um, that'll be in at the end of the video, so have a look at that. But really, really nice jacket. I've been after something like this for a while, so I thought I'd go for it. Got some nice details inside. Anything to do with the Union Jack, I'm a sucker for, so super dry. It's my brand, really. So that's it there. Before we get on the last bit, um, I'll talk quickly about this here. So I'll give you a sneak peek. This is why I haven't really been uploading to do with work as well, but I've been working on there so that's my sneak peek that's all you get to see for now but that that there's my business that i'm starting my own clothing line so it's called london loungewear that's all i say at the minute very close to being able to show you some samples and things that i've got made so stay tuned as soon as i get them through they'll be straight up on the channel so you can see what they look like get your opinions on it what i can improve what you love about it so stay tuned for that but you get another quick look and I'll maybe i'll quickly show you that as well. That's all you're getting for now. But as soon as I get more information myself, I'll pass it straight on to you. But quick segue into my wristwear, the accessories. I didn't buy anything other than this. I got this over Christmas. The Fitbit Charge 2 
really, really good. It just, because I like wear a proper watch, so I didn't want one that looks too much like a normal watch itself. So I can wear both of these and it doesn't look over the top. So at work, I can track my steps like today I've done one thousand, sorry, six and a half thousand. So you know it's not bad effort considering it's only about one o'clock. So hitting my 10,000 steps of target proof every day and it tells you I'm burning about four and a half thousand calories just on the fly. So it helps you track your eating, everything like that as well. So that's the Fitbit Charge 2. I went with a large strap and I've got thin wrists, so I'd recommend you go for the same because it's small. It really is quite tight, so I wouldn't recommend that one. I'm saving the best to last. What? These are the footwear I bought. So as you can see, Jones the Bootmaker boots. There's a hilarious video which I'm going to try and upload onto this because it's just too funny. I was wearing these the other day at work. I was walking into a cafe and I just went flat on my ass. Um, not much grip on these at all. So I just went flying, it was soaking, <laughs> soaking wet. And I'm gonna have to find that and put it on here for you because it's so funny. Like I, was, I was absolutely buckled and the manager was showing every single person at work it the whole day, so that was fun. But as you can see, Ted Baker, these come with two different laces. You've got your black laces and your purple ones. I do wear these for work, so I don't put the purple ones in, but I've worn them on a night out before, so I have. You can see you've got your purple stitching going through here. The leather on them is just so supple. It's really, really soft, so I really, really like these. Got these over Christmas. I love them, absolutely love them. The box that come in is quite cool, it's like a parcel as well, it's a bright green parcel. Um, but that's them there. I did put a leather insole in them just to make them a bit extra comfortable. Wear anyway, but I've got quite wide feet, so you know, I had to go to size up, which made the length a little bit long. Put some insoles in, fix them straight away. But just absolutely lovely, them. I really, really like them a lot. So, now as I say, the best one. See, badass sheepskin slippers. Look at them. That is just comfort. That is screaming comfort right there. I literally live in these. I get home, they come off, these go on, some joggers. I live in them. I've already worn pretty much all of all of the sheepskin down inside them, but they are just so comfortable. Quality is looks as well, lovely suede. And um, just just awesome. I, I'm gonna buy some more of these. I could wear these just out and about in town. They're that comfortable. Then we'll take them off. But that was the video. Um, as I say, I haven't uploaded in a while, as I'm sure you're aware. But I like to I like to keep uploading as often as I can. It's really hard to sort of keep motivated when you're not sort of getting a dress up every day, you're wearing the same clothes, uniform, so it is hard, but I love it. I love doing videos like this, so as I, every time I can, I will. I'm trying to buy some new equipment, new laptop, new camera, but stay tuned for that. But uh, I'll, that's where my main focus is at the minute. But as soon as I get more information, I'll be back and talk. But thank you so much for watching. If you want to share this video, help me out, try and grow the channel a bit. Subscribe as always if you want to see more content and just drop a like just so I know you like the video um, Any comments questions hit me up in the description and um, comment section and I'll see you in the next one. See ya As I say arms quite tight What really, really just nice fit just really really nice fit so put that like that Fairly tight fitting, but that's how I like these type of things, so it's pretty good. Wouldn't get much under this, but it's a really good autumn sort of summer bordering on jacket, so I thought I'd quickly show you that one because it's one of these ones where you sort of need to see it on because it's just hanging it up, doesn't really do it justice, so that's that there. And as I say, cheers for watching. Bye now.